Steve Ursek will maul Pantoja bad. Here's why. Steve Ursek got one of the cleanest boxing in his division. He likes to stay on the outside, box, have some smooth combos, hit the enemy up with some accurate shots. He's very well rounded and he has everything he needs to stop Alex Pantoja. Pantoja's game plan evolves around getting into a slugfest to take the enemy down to make him lose his back. From the back he tries to submit you. As soon as he got your back and as soon as he gets his body triangle in it's over for the round. So how does Steve Ursak fit into all of this? He's pretty tall. He's pretty well rounded. He has the ability to stay on the outside to box Pantoja up because Pantoja has been hit quite a lot. He has been hit a lot against Roy Val, he has been hit a lot against Moreno. Pantoja is a guy who marches forward just like a zombie, takes a lot of hits and gets tired pretty quickly. Taking all those shots and having a pace like a bulldog, that's quite hard in combination. So Steve Ursek is going to need to stay on the outside to manage his cardio and especially he has to stuff all the takedowns because Pantoja is very dangerous from the back and he is one of the best back takers <laughs> if that's the term. He's up there with Charles Oliveira in my opinion and he's up there with having a dirty fight just like Michael Chandler for example. So Ursek has some great grappling as well. I believe he will dance from the outside. He's not the fastest but he's very clean with his shots, very decisive, not too much power behind them but as soon as he get a combo going it's kind of hard to read because he has pretty good head movement and timing. His shots are not the hardest but they hit you and as soon as they mount up a couple of times you can either get the decision win or you can knock somebody out but the thing is that a Pancholja is pretty tough. It's not easy to knock this man out but Steve Ursek is not easy to get knocked out as well. This guy has a chin on him but he still wants to stay out of the clinch, he still wants to stay out of the dogfight because if Pantoja disrupts his game plan, Pantoja will get the win. If he get his back, he got the win. Ursek got great grappling but I believe Pantoja got better grappling. So it's a classic striker versus grappler kind of approach. Ursek also got some submission wins but he will be standing, he will be clipping Pantoja up and you guys will come back to this video and say oh my god Andy you're the best prediction artist on planet earth. I should have bet the house on Ursek. Please don't do that. That would be stupid. But I believe that Ursek is here to stay. Ursek is here to assert dominance and Ursek will win the fight tonight. Watch one of these videos next and subscribe to my channel or I will submit you. See you in the next video. Peace.